Good evening everyone, I am Star Etcher and today I'm playing Disney Dreamlight Valley for Playmus. Um, they just came out with an expansion. I've already played this a little bit and since the last time I made a video of it, I have made a lot of progress. I have opened up everything on the map, done the quest line and everything. So right now, I am kind of just looking for um what is it called what is the new what's the new stuff called oh, wrong wrong button this stuff dream essence or whatever i don't know what it's called yeah not enough what are my missed duties i will say this I hate the Scrabble coin. Come at me if you want. It's not that fun. But I will say this. This game is absolutely bugged. So much so that people in other games uh, were completing <laughs> my um, dream tasks, um, and I'm not, I'm not complaining because that was free dream essence or whatever this crap is. Um, so yeah, oh, we need to feed a monkey. There is a monkey here today. All right, we, um, in order to feed a monkey, you have to give them a five-star meal. So, let's give him fish. All right, he was in here, right? Did he run out? Oh, crap. Come here, monkey. Here you go. Yes, run around the bookcases. Oh my gosh, where did you go? Yes. Uh, come on, monkey. No. How many more times are you gonna make me out? Run after you. Oh my gosh, that one took forever. Look how cute he is, so. Oh my gosh. Actually, I wanted to show you this little guy. I'm not done. This is a gnome. I haven't named him yet. Thinking green go star, like green, the color green because he's wearing green. He is a gnome Christmas tree with a fat bottom. With a fat bottom. Oh! And he's going to have crocheted ornaments and a star hanging down um and maybe a scarf that wraps around like a garland yeah i created him sparkly in the in the red you can see it there <laughs> he's a cutie that started uh that's a pattern I'm creating myself um, uh, because someone asked me to make this or a gnome like this as a Christmas tree. The unfortunate part is that image that they provided was 100% an AI generated image. So I oh is it over here or is it it's down there so it was a hundred percent ai generated uh image the yarn looked awful like it's it's crazy but i'm more than capable and that is the first prototype and funnily enough I'm going, 
I'm going to actually sell this pattern after I get done um, decorating it and making the rest of the pattern. And then make the, like the basis of my um, next one, the Christmas tree. Well, uh, it's already created essentially. Whee! I will say. Oh, that's a pretty cobra. Yeah. All right. Oh, there's another flower. Sorry for the hiccup. Not that I can control those. Oh, let's do this. So, I spent... Oh, okay. Downstairs. I spent like eight or nine hours on this game yesterday. I'm stuck. Um, and... Probably six hours the, the day before playing this game. Um, I'm currently okay. Is it down here or uh, over there? Oh, yes. Lucky me. All right. I'm going to go back over here. Sorry for all the I'm going to turn that around. Oh, if you're curious, the bucket needs to be on the the facing the direction that you want to go. With that, I also brought stitch over here cuz I thought, you know what? Sand. That's what Sand. I also brought um, mini casita over here and Wally. Um, I'm not sure yet who else I want to bring over here. I hope there aren't any ruffians around. Um, there was a suggestion that I bring Bell and and Beast because Gaston's here and maybe make them like a, a little co like community center, like maybe <clears throat> maybe uh, it's upstairs. I think it's pointing upstairs. Yeah. That's a weird place to put a treasure, but... Ugh. Oh, apparently. But, oh, okay. No more. I'm gonna... Go right here and then I'll work my way down to the grove. To maybe like do a um Oh wait, this is a separate one, isn't it? It's a separate one. Yes it is. To make like a um how do I say this? Like a courtyard? Sort of like a little village. Oh, I should have brought yams. Look at that cute little capybara. He's blue with stripes. Oh my god. Is that a big square? No. Alright. The capybara sits in the old gum tree, eating merely in the bushes tea. Oh, that's a kookaburra, not a capybara. <laughs> a kookaburra. 
Well, I guess, I guess a capybara would maybe like that. They look like little guinea pigs, but like super guinea pigs. All right. We need to go to the promenade. The unfortunate thing is that there's so many... Oh, yay. There are so many um, bugs. In this game. Like, it is some... Not unplayable, right? Because you can still play it, but... You're kind of, um... Oh downstairs you're kind of um left with a uh, few options for instance if Disney didn't provide the tropical wood everybody would be kind of stuck um, in their quest questing because you can't get tropical wood. It is not dropping. Um, I have tried even the... We saw the plaza trees to try and get some. Oh, am I gonna get it? Nope. Oh yeah, we got the last one. Was that six? Yeah. All right. We did that one, we did that one. Oh, the Oasis. I think that's the only one we haven't done. And the Ruins. I started to decorate just a little bit. Um, not very much. Still thinking. You saw the house uh, around Stitch, um, and who else? There was another one that I was working on. Oh, I did this little area that Simba is like Being brave doesn't stuck in every time. And I absolutely love that flower bed. It's called Luminescent Flower? Luminous flowers? Oh, downstairs. Hey, there's a monkey. Okay. That was weird. All right. I haven't quite figured out how this works, right? Nothing ever spawns. It could be that I just clean it up, but. So, I'm curious. Um, have you been playing A Rift in Time? And it is it something that you're enjoying? Because I'm enjoying it. I just... I feel a little frustrated with some of them. Yes, finally. Um, for instance, I am okay with the storyline, right? But you can get it done in like an hour it's like 
if you push hard for it, it's like an hour and 12 minutes or something like that. Which isn't a lot of gameplay, right? The majority of your gameplay is trying to get the... Um, the... Uh, what is it? Dream dust? But not like the eternal dust or whatever. Uh, in order to... Um, open the areas because you need to have a few of them open I think the problem is that certain game developers uh, not just Disney but uh, other game developers don't take into account the people who rush content or who have a lot of um, good, not good, how do I say this, like, oh, I didn't see that, who have the enthusiasm, so to speak, of the game and, and kind of um, rush forward. Now. Don't get me wrong. I do not like time gating at all. I think it's horrible. For instance, the whole Jafar quest line, three quests in and I can't finish the storyline. That makes zero sense to me. Um, but at the same time, I just, I don't know. Time gating's not fun. This valley what? Seems Why is it giving me dirt? But not like the beast castle. Not like the beast castle. Ooh, let's let's try this. Um, out of curiosity, ephemeral is what it's said, right? Let's do this. So this gives a fair, a fairmal dust. I'm just going to call it eternity dust. Okay. Why? Maybe I'm maybe I'm doing this wrong. Let me look it up. Right? No. Vacuum. Oh, here we go. Here's the the level three vacuum picks up everything on the ground, including something like vegetables or fruit that are scattered around when your friends drop extra and they do count towards the star path. Oh my God. Okay. So basically, these aren't working, right, at level one. Let's do this. I have enough. I was going to save it for my next staff, but let's see. Oh, okay, so I can't. Why can't I? Oh, okay, we need cores. Got it. So we have everything else except for the cores. I did make a regular gardener, which goes up to 20 spaces. No, 24 spaces. I suppose All right. everyone's been telling you that I'm the bad guy. So this is the uh, gardener. Um, it's got 24 slots. Um, and I've kind of... 
figured out, right? Okay. So you can either plant these or spend like okay, I don't have I don't have the money. Let's do yams. Um, right, so literally for me the hardest part that I that bothers me is the watering and the harvesting. Literally, I just hold E and let it go. <laughs> I'm okay with cutting down my time doing this, and I'm gonna at some point do a bunch of these for pumpkins. Um, oh my gosh, I forgot that I had 24. <laughs> I just was talking about it too, guys. Alright, so Wow Alright, let's go ahead and finish. Hi Wally. So basically it does the watering, it does the collecting. You can technically have it seed and it will seed. And it's super easy. I absolutely love this. And then the cooking also. Um, what can I say? Um, when I imagined far off berry places, salad is what I like. I the only thing... Okay, did I not... Cool. Oh, I didn't click autofill. So basically, I choose berry salad, autofill, start cooking. I choose how many I want to cook. I'm gonna do 10. 250 is literally something that I um, pick up easily enough, like right there. There we go. There we go. And by the way, that little cooking thing will fill out these tasks. So there's that. But anyway, that's going to be the end of this video today. Thanks for joining me for Playmas. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.